In this video, I will show you how to install Kali Linux in VirtualBox on Windows 10. Follow me. First of all we need to install VirtualBox. Open your browser and search on Google. Download VirtualBox. Open this link. Click on Windows Hosts. It will be downloading automatically. We will now install VirtualBox. Minimize it. Now we will download Kali Linux latest ISO file. Search on Google. Download Kali Linux. Open this. My Windows operating system is 64-bit. I downloading 64-bit Kali Linux installer image. How to check Windows 10 operating system. Follow me. Press Windows button plus X. Click on System. If your system type is 32-bit, then you need 32-bit Kali Linux ISO image file. Open VirtualBox machine and click on New. Name. Type. Kali Linux 2020.2 Type Linux version If your operating system is 64-bit, then select Debian 64-bit. Otherwise you select Debian 32-bit. Memory size Note don't select maximum RAM memory. My system RAM memory is 6 GB. I am selecting 2 GB. 1024 MB is equal to 1 GB. Now we create a hard drive for Kali Linux. So, click on Create. VDI. VirtualBox Desk Image. Next. Select Dynamically Allocated and then Next. Select here Kali Linux Hard Drive Size. It's depend on your need. Remember 40 GB storage is minimum requirement for Kali Linux. Before starting, check your system settings. Click on Windows Search button in Taskbar and search command prompt. Type here, system info and press enter. Check Hyper-V requirements. If virtualization not yes. Your PC is not ready for virtual machine. Then you go to your system BIOS settings. I am showing some companies virtualization settings. Type run in Windows search bar. Oprah run app. Now type ms config and click on OK.
Go to boot. Select advanced options. Number of processors. Select maximum processors. Restart your PC and open again VirtualBox. Select Kali Linux and go to Settings. Click on Advanced. And. Follow me. System. Uncheck Floppy. Check Network. I have four cores of processors. Then I will share two processors with VirtualBox. Video memory is graphics memory. 40 megabytes is good for normal graphics. If you want better graphics quality, you can increase video memory. Storage settings is most important. Choose a desk file. Select downloaded Kali Linux ISO image file and click on OK. Before starting make sure, your PC internet connection is working. Now click on Start. Start up disk. Select Kali Linux installer file. And start. Graphical install. Mouse is not worked here. Press enter from your keyboard. Select language whatever you want. Choose your country location. Choose keyword layout. It will take several minutes. You can change host name. I am starting with Kali. Domain name. Leave empty. Enter your name. And continue. Remember. It's your username. It's most important for login. Don't forget it. Create Kali Linux login password. And then continue. Choose your time zone, and continue. Use entire disk, continue. Again continue. All files in one partition, continue. Finish partitioning, continue. Mark yes, and then continue. Proxy information. Leave blank. Continue. It will take several minutes. I skip this. Don't change anything. Just continue. It will take several time. How much? It's depend on your PC. I skipped. Grub boot loader. Yes, and continue. Boot loader installation. Select VirtualBox Hard Disk. Continue. I skipped. Finish the installation. Continue. Installation completed. Kali Linux is starting.
Enter. Username and password. If you have any problem please comment on this video.